Yo, we're back on the Fellowship SMP, and that first time lapse is the reason we're a little bit late with all this video. But we took about 25 hours of uh, replay f mod footage and made that into that little time lapse that wasn't so little. And yeah, it uh, kind of set us behind a little bit. But now we're all ready. We got a bunch of stuff planned. We got a bunch of stuff going already. I am at Blue's Wither Skeleton Farm, so we came over here to get some Wither Skulls, or Wither Skeleton Skulls, and then get a Wither Skeleton uh, to bring back with us, but now there's other people on, so can't really do that. So for today's episode, we are going to be taking a Wither Skeleton to our lab for some tests, maybe, or maybe just to uh, make a neat little decoration that I have planned. And besides that, I want to make a wither killing chamber, so I'll be breaking some bedrock and then also trapping a wither just for fun, just because it'll look neat. I'm going to make a little wither reactor area, and it's just going to be some beacons and a wither in the middle, and yeah, I think it'll look neat, and that's the only reason I'm going to do it. I'm going to risk my whole base just to uh, have a neat little wither in it, and of course we're going to do some egg stuff. Before we get to any of the fun stuff, let's jump into a time lapse of getting some glass put into the bedrock and breaking some of the bedrock and seeing about a wither killing chamber. things first we should show off <laughs> a couple new friends so we got this guy we got our dragon skull and it's just a wither skeleton with a uh, slab pushed through him and then a dragon head on him so he sits here and he looks all through I might put some stuff around it to make him look a little bit more sealed in but yeah that was what started the whole wither farm needing thing or wither skeleton farm needing thing then down here We got a bunch of iron blocks laid out, so this will be our first floor. I still need to do the roof and the walls, but before we do that, we got our friend over here. He's a muscly boy, and he's a creeper golem. So he's a little cursed, but he guards the farm, or well, more just hangs out over it. But yeah, I thought I'd make a little addition to this see-through part up here. Then down here is where it gets more exciting. So we got all the purple. We got one floating island. And then we have our wither killing chamber. So we take one, two, three, four. And we'll put those in there. One, two, three. Pop this right in here. This is going to get real loud. Use our wither whacker on him. You just run in. And we get a star. Throw that in there. And then over here, the reason why I have this all blocked up like this is first, let's go like this. Let's see. We have some blocks. How do we do this? It's right here, here, and here. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna pop this up here, 
We're gonna pop this right here. I'm gonna summon a wither right here. And then he'll pop in here. We'll push this over so it'll shield us from the uh, explosion damage. And then we will put glass there. We will pop both of those over and hopefully trap him in place. So that is part of the plan we have for today. Do I want to get into it yet? No, I am terrified of it going wrong. So let's go to the egg. Come on egg, give us something fun. <laughs> Don't say like, do your work or anything like that. Come on. Deliver a named animal to a fellow's base. All right, we can do that one. A named animal. Is a ravager an animal? See, Chris did try and demote me. He made me a janitor on his ship. Maybe we should uh, bring our own ship over there and uh, put a little friend. Well, I got a little bit carried away. <laughs> the one thing I was supposed to do, I didn't do. So instead, there's a new ship at Chris's space. <laughs> so, Captain Kaz is back. And he has his own ship. And, well, for now, <laughs> this is all I'm doing because suddenly it is 5.30 in the morning. So, next thing we're going to do, hopefully Chris doesn't notice the ship before then, is sneak a Ravager onto it. Or maybe I'll sneak one in. I don't want to sneak one onto his because that's kind of dangerous. But I will get a Ravager as a pet and put it on my ship. Well, the sun is coming up in game and in real life, so I will finish this soon. Hopefully before Chris gets on game. got him on and we got him named and let's see if we can see his name with this he is Captain Steed so yeah that is Captain Kaz's friendly Steed he's very very friendly he's not stuck at all he's just chilling because he's friendly and there's Captain Kaz on his new boat and his new Steed so this is my present to Chris because he wanted to try and make the, me the janitor and uh, the egg told me I had to move an animal somewhere. So ravagers are animals and uh, this one is now living with him. Next thing we're going to do is we are going to trap the wither and make the reactor. So let's jump over to that now. It's finally time. <laughs> We're gonna try and get this done. Hopefully it goes well the first time, otherwise there's gonna be a lot of damage, I'm guessing. And yeah, I'm not looking forward to cleaning that up, but okay, so if we place this here, that'll push that into his head. Then we just have to swap to here, put one of those in there, and then swap that in when he does his blasting and it gets blocked. And hopefully he doesn't fly out. That's the big thing. So, here we go. Nope, that's not what we wanted to do. I forgot to summon him. <laughs> yeah, I'm not nervous about this at all. Uh, I don't know what I don't know what you're talking about. All right. So we take this. We put this up. Here. What? Why would I put that there? Why would I put that there? There we go. So put this right here. All right, that in place, here we go. All right, ready? Place this right here. Oh my God, did we get it? Oh my gosh. Ah, uh, I don't like that sound. Oh 
Oh my gosh, did we? Oops, that's not right. Switch this to this. Oh my gosh. And reactor is lit. Now, we do want to break one of these and name him. But we will do that after we do some tests on him later. So, oh god. Oh, it doesn't do anything. Woo! Random blue skulls, that's fine. We do not have to worry about them at all. All right. So we will make a uh, special test subject out of this guy. Leave him locked up in there. And next project, we might want to start some islands. So I did a little bit of work on this little first island that I had started. It kind of doesn't really, I don't know, doesn't really do it for me. I will need to make some changes and stuff, see if I can make myself like it a little bit better. Um, I just don't think, maybe the dripstone just doesn't go with it, or maybe the green stuff doesn't go with it, but I don't know, it needs some changes. Other than that, we got this. We got a little reactor started, and this is not going to be the ground level, so you don't really have to worry about this part, but I am going to, maybe I'll replace this with some more of that, and then, yeah, there's going to be another level, probably two layers of glass, or maybe one, I'm not really sure yet. But this is not going to be the ground layer because I don't want there to be spawns or torches. So I'll probably have a layer of glass over all of the bedrock. And then I also want to try something scary. So let's take this. Ooh, ooh, did it work? Okay, that worked. <laughs> All right, so that worked. So I can. So this is our new wither reactor. I would love to replace the crying obsidian on top of him, but I think that would definitely free him. So the next thing we're going to do, I don't think I'm going to start on the islands yet. I think I want to finish the floor. So we will get a ton of glass and probably start working on that. See if we can get something we like on the ground. There is one problem though. It's kind of an exciting problem, but I think we are going to be updating to 1.20 soon. So that's really exciting, but will mean some mods and stuff will stop working as much. So I think my clear glass might go for a little bit, which will make that not as fun. And just a few other things. Hopefully none of the resource packs break because I'm not sure if any of that's updated. But we'll see. So this video has taken forever to put together compared to usual. I put a lot more work into it. I did a lot more stuff in one video than I've done in a long time. And yeah, if you liked it, please like, comment, subscribe, all that fun stuff. It really helps out. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye.